hello everyone welcome back to my channel this is the part two of how to cover your cake i've done the part one video where i covered the the cake with the fondant so now this one that i'm, I'm trying to show you now is how to get a sharp edge so this is part two if you've not watched the part one i think it's best you watch the part one so that you understand what we're doing so now i want to show you how to get the sharp edge that sharp edge that you see in cake so i'm using this two smoother so you need two smoother so now i'm going like this so watch me So you can see the difference between here and here so we need we need this all around so that's what we call sharp edge so i'll have to continue so that i'll finish it basically what i'm doing is i have two smoother so i'm i place one here then i'm using this one to drag the fondant so that we get the sharp edge So turn it around take your time with it this might take you 15 to 20 minutes so just take your time don't be in a hurry Keep turning, turning it around. Take your time. Don't be in a hurry. If you are a beginner, this might be a bit difficult, but don't be discouraged. I didn't start baking today. I've been baking for five years, so it's a little bit easy for me, but trust me, nobody's perfect. We're all trying and learning. So I'm going to use my smoother and I'll go around the cake. So use a pizza cutter and cut around the edge.
fold this again because you might need it for another cake so you don't waste it so guys this is how to get a sharp edge in a cake subscribe to my channel share this video with your friends and family and i will see you in another one Bye-bye!